In a report from CN Tech Post, China's largest foundry, Semiconductor Manufacturing International Corporation, or SMIC for short, is joining the likes of TSMC and other large foundries with the announcement of small-scale 7 nanometer semiconductor manufacturing starting production in Q4 2020. SMIC's N plus one 7 nanometer node is set to bring a variety of improvements over its current 14 nanometer production node, such as a 20% increase in performance, an improvement in logic density of 63%, and a total dye area reduction of 55%, according to Dr. Liang Mengsong, co-CEO of SMIC. As of this time, no information is available as to when mass production of SMIC's N plus one node will begin. Again, now SMIC has not identified any potential customers, though the announcement to begin small-scale production in Q4 2020 is earlier than expected. SMIC's expenses in preparation for 7 nanometer production will reach $3.1 billion, reaching over the company's yearly income with $2 billion going towards assembly retooling of its 12-inch wafer fabrication plant in Shanghai and $500 million to its fabrication plant in Beijing. Now, SMIC does not appear to be an imminent threat to either Samsung or TSMC, but it will be interesting to see how SMIC's 7 nanometer process performs against its competitors. Considering SMIC's 14 nanometer process made up a meager 1% of SMIC's total revenue, the company will need to grow its customer base significantly to justify the massive expenditure of 7 nanometer retooling. TSMC has already started production of its second generation 7 nanometer node with EUV technology in contrast with SMIC, which states that both the N plus one and N plus two processes are not going to employ EUV lithography. Though, in the future, this will change. For more on this and other news, follow the link in the description and make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that we don't miss you in the next one.